All right, Shalom. First off, we're going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashim Rakak with Dosh. We're going to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And it's a Shay Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing a push of the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay? The title of this video is Don't Let Your Devotion of When You Didn't Know God Outweigh Your Devotion. Of you knowing him now okay that's pretty much the title of this video okay and it's Galatians 4 and 8 how be it when you knew not God you did service unto them which by nature are no gods okay basically before you came into this truth okay you was devoted on to whatever it was man okay way before you came into this truth on, on to these uh, demons or, or idols or whatever life that you was living okay now you come into this truth and your your devotion okay which the word devoted means very loving or loyal okay loyal faithful true staunch steadfast constant committed dedicated devout food I mean a fond Loving, affectionate, caring, admiring. Okay? Don't let what you was admiring, okay, the things of this world, okay, stop you or, or outweigh your devotion towards your how about some y'all side, man. Okay? Because you got people that come into this truth and they, they fall off. Okay? But guess what? Before they came into this truth, they was... They was into to uh, let's say music or or some some bullshit from from college, okay. And then you come into this truth and you just get lazy, you know. And 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 like for example, you see how these um so called Muslims, right? When it's their time to pray, they sit down that 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 uh that rug. Okay, and then they and they actually praying to a, to a rock. Okay, to an idol, but then you come into this truth, and you you don't you you don't pull out nothing. You you know you don't even pull out your scriptures. You don't even watch videos. You know, don't let that 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 past devotion when you was when you was worshiping these things that that aren't any gods. Okay. Outweigh what you, what you, your, your knowledge right now of how you're supposed to be serving Yahweh Basim Yahushua. Okay, it says, but now after that you have known God, or rather, or rather are known of God. Okay, because the the Lord showed you mercy. Okay, by waking you up. And 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 giving you this truth okay he showed you mercy okay and it's a blessing to be woke up man because when you look around it's not many people are it's not given to the to the wisest people it's not given to the strongest people okay it says how turn ye again to the weak and beggarly elements where unto you desire again to be in bondage Okay, so so when you was when you was in the world, okay, you was you was basically in bondage, man. You was lost, man. Okay, but now here you are. You in this truth. You know the truth, man. Okay. It's First Corinthians twelve and two. When you in this truth, you're supposed to be devoted, loving this truth. Okay, loyal. Okay, what's the word loyal mean? Giving or showing firm and constant support, constant, constantly, or allegiance to a person or institution. Okay? You're supposed to be loyal unto Yahweh by Shem Yahushua. Okay? He trusted you with, 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 with this, this, this truth. Okay? And, and you have to do what you're supposed to do. Okay? Um... Let me see, 1 Corinthians 12 and 2. 
you know that you were Gentiles, okay, before you knew that you was an Israelite, okay, carried away, or you even got people that, that know that they're Israelites, you know, carried away onto to some craziness, man, and they put on these crazy um, garments and, you know, different things like that in order to try to make it seem like they're part of the, you know, like the faith, you know, and you ain't got to do all that, you know, it's, it's really simple, the scripture says that the Lord's burden is not, 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 uh, it's not hard, man. You know, his ways are not grievous. Okay? What's wrong with, you know, the, uh, devoting, <laughs> uh, time for the Lord, man? You know, it's not, nothing wrong with that. Okay? Like, you just had this video of this guy, you know, um, from, uh, the Good Samaritans. You know, took a whole month off. You know, he couldn't even find the time to, to do a video. Okay? It says, you know that you were Gentiles carried away onto these dumb idols even as you were led. Right? Continuing on. First Peter 4 and 1. For as much then as Yahweh Shah has suffered for us in the flesh, arm yourselves likewise with the same mind. And that's one thing too. A lot of people don't believe Yahweh Shah actually came, man. Okay? And that's one of the reasons why they, they fall off, because they don't have that, 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 that faith. It says, for he that has suffered in the flesh has ceased from sin, that he no longer should live the rest of his time in the flesh to the lust of men, but to the will of Yahweh, okay, the Most High. For the time past of our life may suffice us to have wrought the will of the Gentiles, when we walked in lasciviousness, you know, un, un, um, it says lust, you know, being shame, shameful, man, okay, excess of wine, okay, revelings, see what this word reveling mean. Strong's G2970, Comas, Comas. Okay, a nocturnal or riotous procession of half drunken and frolicsome fellows who, after su supper, parade through the streets with torches and music in honor of Bacchus or some other deity and sing and play before houses of male and female friends, hence, use generally of feast and drinking parties that are protracted till late at night and indulge in reverie. Okay, so before you came into the truth, you might have been somebody that was, you know, partying, you know, always had all the women and stuff like that, you know, it says banquetings and, ab and ab abominable idolatries. Okay, before the before you came into this truth, these are the things that you was doing, man. Okay, and you ain't supposed to allow these things. Okay, now that you know the know the Lord or you you're a known of the Lord, okay, to go back onto that, that wicked stuff or or to just give up, man. Okay. First Thessalonians one and four. Knowing brethren, beloved, your election of God, okay, you the election you selected, okay? For our gospel came not unto you in word only, but also in power and in the Holy Spirit. And in much assurance, okay? And we try to, every brother, you know, should be assuring one another that Yahweh Shah is going to come, man, okay? That this is the truth, you know? That you got to, you got to wait, you got to watch as well as pray, okay? Pray, 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 man. There's nothing wrong with praying, man, okay? Meditate on these scriptures. Okay, much assurance because the word this 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 truth is a, a promise, man, from the most talent to us. And the word promise means to guarantee. Okay, that so we know for sure, a hundred percent sure that this stuff is going to happen. Okay, Strong's G 4136, play Rafaria, play Rafaria. Okay, and it says full assurance, most certain confidence now 
it say pluriferia, okay? Now, one of the words that came to, to, to mind was a large uh, prethora, okay? A large or excess amount of something, okay? And it's, the scripture said, and much assurance, okay? Much assurance, okay? It's a plethora of knowledge, okay? Overabundance, okay? So, so it's always, it's a lot of videos to watch, man, okay? You always see a lot of different brothers doing a lot of different videos, man, okay? No, hey, watch different, different camp videos, man, you know? Watch, watch different, you know, uh, things to get you in the spirit. You know, if you find yourself in that, that uh, slacking mode, it says, As you know what manner of men we were among you for your sake. Okay, and when certain brothers get you know animated, okay, some sometimes that's for our brothers to you know to 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 uh to get up in the spirit, man, you know, because this is the truth, man. Okay, and this is what we we what we gonna die for, man. You know, if the if the Lord put the spirit on us, or or, or we if we have if we have to go through that, man, you know. Hey, <laughs> we know that how Esau is the devil, you know, and and a, and a guy that that isn't devoted, you know, in his truth, you basically saying, you know, you you still want to be a slave, man. It says, and you became followers of us and of the Lord, having received the word in much affliction with the joy of the Holy Spirit, so that you were examples to all that believe in Macedonia and Achaia, okay, from. For from you sounded out the word of the Lord, not only in Macedonia and in Achaia, but also in every place of your faith to God work is spread ab abroad, so that we need not to speak anything. For they themselves so of us what manner of entering in we had unto you, and how you turned to God from idols to serve the living and true God. So that's what we, we, we're serving a living and true power, man. Okay? And this is the last scripture now I'm going to get. Joshua 24 and 15. And if it seemed evil unto you to serve the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh choose you this day whom you, whom you will serve, whether the gods which your, your father served that were on the other side of the flood or the god of the Amorites in whose land you dwell, but as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. How about Shemyao Sa? Okay? So if you're going to serve the Lord, then you need to do it, man. Okay? Ain't nothing to it but to do it. And it's simple. Okay? It's real simple. And that's all you got to do is keep it simple. Some guys when coming to this truth, they want to, you know, try to be all extremely deep, you know? That's not what this truth is about, man. Okay? The scripture says, okay, I'm going to get it, okay, Lamentations 3 and 26, it is good that a man should both hope and quietly wait for the salvation of the Lord, okay, so so we supposed to be waiting for, for the Lord, man, okay, it's good, you know, but don't, don't, don't be trying to go all super deep, you know, to try to make it seem like this, that's what this truth is about, man. You know, either. Okay, just just devote yourself unto the Lord, man. Okay? Be affectionate, man. Care about this truth, man. Okay? Be committed. Same way how you was committed onto, you know, whatever life you was before this truth. Be be committed and dedicated onto this truth now that you come into it, man. Okay? Because this, this is your life, man. Okay? So with that one, say Salawam.